All right, so here's an update on LeBron James. I know you guys want updates. So here's what we know so far. LeBron flew on a private jet earlier yesterday, earlier on the, thir on the 30th, right? Sat Saturday, he flew on a private jet into Los Angeles to kick off his free agency. He is going to meet face-to-face -face with the Los Angeles Lakers. He initially told the Cleveland Cavaliers he had nothing else to talk to him about. They wanted to be able to discuss their free agent plans, their uh, trade opportunities on the table, you know, to, to make this team better and appease LeBron James. They feel pretty much handicapped right now. They can't do nothing. LeBron told them, look, pretty much him and his team told the Cavs, pretty much it ain't nothing else for us to talk about right now. I want to make this decision without you guys, and I don't want y'all making all y'all decisions based on me. It's no telling if I'm going to be there or not. So these, that, that's pretty much where he's at with it. And um, LeBron James, I do know this. This he did do. According to Dave McMenamin, Dave McMenamin, excuse me, I'm talking so fast, I got so much going on. According to Dave McMenamin, LeBron did call Cavs GM Kobe Altman at 12.01. Or maybe Cavs GM Kobe Altman called LeBron. They were on the phone at 12.01 as soon as free agency started. And they did talk. They talked with LeBron and his agent. That I know. Now, what came of that? I don't know. Maybe LeBron heard something that Kobe liked. Maybe Kobe has a trade on the table that he could take. Maybe for a guy like Kevin Love. Who knows? All I know is Cavs are getting a foaming and LeBron is giving the Lakers a face-to-face. -face. That can't be good for the Cleveland Cavaliers. LeBron and Magic and company are going to meet face-to-face. -face. They have their pitch together. I believe that pitch is going to involve DeMarcus Cousins. We'll see what happens from there. At least LeBron gave the Cavs a phone call. He didn't want to do that as of 48 hours ago. Thank God for the time, love, support. This LeBron James free agency saga continues. The third time we've done this. And this one, I wouldn't say is, ex is as exciting as 2010, but it's definitely more exciting than 2014. Y'all talk to me, comment box below. I'm out. I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. Right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty.